All right, now in lesson number four, we're talking about putting right and left English on the ball. I'm going to shoot this ball straight into the center. If you remember, it came straight back into the cue when we were doing the straight stroking lesson. I'm going to apply some right English, probably a good full tip's width. When I say tip's width, I mean the end of this cue, the width of that tip. It's going to put a full tip of right, and you'll see that the ball just comes straight back to the right. Okay, now I'm going to come over here and I'm going to put a full tip of left. I'm aiming for the center diamond. The English will take it from there. My left didn't quite take as strong. You'll notice this went left, that went right. Now, as far as learning side spin, one of the best things that I could say anyone could do to practice would be start practicing banking balls around the table. That's a three rail bank. I see that it fell short here. I'm going to apply a little bit more right English, hit it in the same spot it should go in. <clears throat> Went pretty close. Practice coming over to this end of the table. Bank to this end with reverse English, left English. See if you can make a cue ball come straight up the table. Did you get that shot of that or no? Oh yeah. I didn't shut it off. That's good. Because the other way I'm going to put a lot of right English. Cue ball goes straight up the table. Practice. From this point to the center should take you dead in the corner. You can practice your bank speed just by doing that. Sometimes